I'm here with Dr. Romano to do a problem on electrochemistry for the DAT. Wow, Dr. Romano, that's a big book you have there. Don't worry about the size of the damn book. Why don't we pay some attention to the size of this chemical reaction that I have here for you. The first thing I want to do here, this is a very, very important DAT question that many, many kids have difficulty with. I'm going to give you four half cell reactions. And I'm going to ask you which one of these is the best oxidizing agent and which is the best reducing agent. I'm going to show you an easy way to do this. First of all, a positive E0 means the reaction is spontaneous. That means that the reaction will go under its own direction with just mixing the chemicals together. A negative E0 means the reaction is non-spontaneous. And that's when you need a battery or an external voltage source to make the reaction go. Now, in the first reaction, I notice it's the most positive E0. So the guy that's the most positive means he wants to be reduced the most of everyone. So the more positive one will make... So I'm going to write positive E0 loves, loves to go. So that means that this first reaction loves to go. So that would mean that cobalt plus 3 loves to be reduced. And if it loves to be reduced, it would make cobalt plus 3 the best oxidizing agent. So that is a slam dunk if they ever ask you what's the best oxidizing agent. It's the one with the, pos the most positive E0. Now it gets a little tricky. What's the best reducing agent? That means we're looking for the substance that wants to be oxidized. Well, as you can see, none of these are written in terms of oxidation. So that means that every one of these must be reversed. So that would put this at negative 182, negative 150, positive 0.44, and positive 0.76. So that means that this reaction in reverse would be the most positive. What would the reverse of that be? It would be zinc going to zinc plus two plus two electrons. So that would be the most favorable. If it's the most favorable, zinc loves to be oxidized the most. If it wants to be oxidized the most, that means that it would be the best reducing agent. And therefore the answer would be zinc. So there you have it. That's the way you solve this. I have really an easy question in Destroyer on this. Um, but I do mention about how to do the reducing agent in the solution. So look that question over. I hope this clears up um, a problem that a lot of students have difficulty with. And remember, make it fun and bubbly, and you will kick some ass. All right, good day to you, Alexandra. Bye-bye.